everybody, Trailer Park Homesteader here. I know it's been a really long time since I've been here. Um, I think the last the last uh, video I put up was probably November. I'm not really even sure. But I didn't want you guys to think I totally forgot about you. It's, you know, it's been a crazy couple months, which I know everybody says that. Um, and I'm no different. So I'm going to try to be more consistent in the future. And I'm really sorry. Sorry. Um... <laughs> But anyway, so I wanted to, I, t I went to Aldi's today, and I just wanted to do a quick Aldi's haul. Um, it is almost the new year, and my one and only resolution is to start making more freezer to crock pot meals, things that I can have ready and healthy and fresh for when I get home from work. And then, you know, hopefully spend less money going out to eat and lunches and things like that. I really want to spend... Um, spend my money on something else. You know, I'd like to take a vacation this year, like go away, take a vacation. And, um, so we'll see, you know what, hopefully it'll happen. I'm not, you know, I'm not too worried if it doesn't, but I'm not, I'm not going to try to count it out. I want to do it. I want to, we can all do it. What's your resolution? You know, I, I've made so many resolutions in the, over the years and I, I don't know that I've kept one. Okay, wait, no, that's not true. Two years ago this time, I said, I'm going to drink a glass of red wine every single day because it's so healthy for you. Kept that one. Yeah, whatever. Um, it is good for you, though. Really, totally is. I swear. Ask my doctor. He'll tell you. He's really awesome that way. All right. Let's go in. I'll show you guys um, what I got at Aldi's, and then I, I will see you soon. Bye, kids. Cheers. Hey everybody. Okay. So I got everything out here to show you what I got at Aldi today. I spent about $54 and I really got a lot. So let's just get into it. Um, I bought these. These are what I call saltines. I think they're way better than saltines. They are my favorite cracker ever. If you like um, crackers like this, you need to go to Aldi and get these because they really are amazing. I got some... Garden salad mix, two um, two packages of mushrooms. I'll be putting those in my Salisbury steak that I took up for a freezer meal. Um, I got this bag of Field and Farm mini peppers. I love these; they're really sweet. Got some a pack of um, baby carrots, some green peppers, and these are three in a pack. I think they're like a dollar twenty nine or something. Anyway, I buy these all the time, and if I don't use them all, I'll, I'll chop them up, and I'll put them in the freezer and put them in casseroles later. I got some cilantro, because I love it. Um, two English cucumbers, which I grow every year, but, you know, we're out because it is that time of year. You can't get anything out of your garden anymore, unless you have a greenhouse, which I don't. Got some, um, some little grape tomatoes. Big bag of onions. Um, this cooking stock beef cooking stock and I'm gonna put this this is actually going, gonna go into a chili recipe now I've never tried this but it's really good I was hungry when I was in there it's a quinoa crunch southwest burger and I thought we'd take these to work because you can actually nuke them and I have salsa and put toppings on them yum can't wait to try that I got a head of lettuce we have some BLTs one night um I got some Dijon mustard, because I'm going to make what is called world's best chicken. If you go over to, she's on, she's in her apron. She has that recipe. Or you can Google it. I Googled it too. It's the same recipe that she used. I was out of ketchup, so I had to get that. I got half a gallon of 1% milk. I usually buy skim milk, but all the skim milk they had was completely expired. So I don't know. Um, I got, let's see, I got a can of pinto, big can of pinto beans. Um, two cans of diced tomatoes. I don't know where the other one is. I got some cannelli beans. Kidney beans. Uh, Great Northern beans. Guess what I'm making tonight. More, there's those other diced tomatoes. I got some uh, creamy chicken soup and some creamy mushroom soup because I used all of mine from yesterday. Yesterday when I made the pot pie. Got myself some Greek yogurt because I love it. And I've been on antibiotics, so I have to take yogurt. 
Uh, I love this this bread. You know, this is a really good, this is a really good wheat bread. So, got some of that. Um, also, got these flour tortillas. I'm going to make some breakfast burritos to, for the freezer, and then we'll make some, um, we'll have some, you know, some Mexican burritos one night. Got some uh, zesty Italian and light balsamic vinaigrette. I've never tried these brands, so I'm really looking forward to that. Got some Honey Nut Crispios, and these are every bit as good as Honey Nut Cheerios, in my opinion. I got some lean ground beef for the Salisbury steak. A big pack of chicken. This will go into about three recipes. Uh, this is boneless, skinless chicken breast. I usually like to use thighs, but they had this, and you know, I didn't even think to look for thighs. And tell me if you guys know what this is. Ta-da! It's brown Schweiger. If anybody in your family is German, or you've been to Germany, or you know someone who's German, you've probably heard them talk about brown Schweiger. It is amazing. There's another word for it, and I can't. I think. I want to say it's wheat for milk, but that doesn't sound right. So I don't really know. But, um, anyway, so, yeah, this is everything that I got at Aldi. I think I did really well. I'm going to, so I'm going to make the Salisbury steak today with some mushroom gravy and get that in the freezer. I'm going to make uh, this chili. Now, this chili that I'm going to make today and put in the freezer is em Emerald Lagasse's um, Five Bean Chili. It is amazing, you guys. You have to try it. So good. I'm going to make a few salads and, you know, put those away for my lunch. I probably won't do that today because I don't go back to work till Monday. Um, let's see. I'm going to make some uh, potato and Italian sausage. Well, it's Swiss potato and Italian sausage. It's the potato soup with Italian sausage and Swiss peas and all these really good things. And when I make it, I'll take you guys along. Um, so I think that's it. What do you think? Pretty cool, huh? Um, I love these veggies. Uh, I can't wait to grow my garden, though, because then I, whoops, I pretty much stop buying vegetables in the summer because I grow them all. All right, there you go. i tell you what, you guys have a safe, have a happy new year, and we will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.